Okay, so this session what I'll be doing is uh, I'll be skinning this witch, so I'll be taking the dark skin off. So the first of all, what I'm going to do is just turn the fish round. I'm going to find where the, uh, the fleshy part is, make it nice and taut, using the tip of my knife, it's going to come round there, not all the way through, just scoring through the skin. And what I'm going to do is make it create a little flap of skin with the tip of my knife, like so. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to take a dry cloth and what I'm going to do is I'm going to pinch the cloth either side of that skin, like this. Then what I'm going to do is just going to turn it round, using my thumb, grabbing hold of that skin, using the thumb, going to go all the way down the fish. Moving the cloth down as you go, right the way down to the bottom, it's fantastic noise. Turning it round, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to grab that skin in between, uh, in between the cloth. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to roll the skin from the fish and at the same time I'm going to use my non-knife hand is to push the fish down. So grab hold of the skin. You have to be careful, this is going to rip. I can tell it's going to rip. To there, not too bad. Get to a certain point, then we're going to push our thumb straight up. You have to be very, very careful because there is a little bone just there. And if you were to catch yourself, it is quite painful. Okay, so I'm going to turn the fish round. Again, I'm going to grab hold of the skin, using my thumb, all the way down the fish, pulling the skin into the middle, like so. Turn the whole thing round. And what you need to do is grab hold of that skin and keep the skin down. Put your thumb on there and then just pull it all the way down to the bottom of the fish. Okay, by hand skinning, what it's done is actually created uh, a silver skin. So I like to call it nature's cling film. It just retains a little bit moisture, a bit more moisture in the fish as it's cooked. And obviously to finish off this fish, I need to remove all the fins, otherwise they just dry up. So again, using the smiley face as I call it, come right way round, nip off the tail. Start with the right hand side first of all. Going to go all the way up the fish, make it nice and neat and tidy to there to just take that, those fins off. I'm going to turn it round, do exactly the same thing on this side, all the way up to the top. To there. Take all these other little fins off, because I say they just get dried out. Turn it round, and what we've done is we've skinned that fish on the one side. If you want to do it both sides, then obviously just repeat the process on the second side. Okay, so what we've done with there is we've skinned and trimmed it. Sometimes your customer would say to you, I don't want the head on, so if we need to take that off, just grab the head, we're gonna use the heel of the knife, just follow that all the way around to there, and then take it off. Now if we're doing that, if we turn it around and look inside, there is a bloodline left in there. So what we need to do is use the tip of our scissors, we're gonna go in there and we're just gonna flick all that out. Because, because again, what will happen is it will taste quite, quite bitter during the cooking process. We get to there, a little bit of a clean up. Obviously I would actually run it underneath the tap. Just take all that part out and there you are. So what I've done, skinned. So we've got a pan ready witch and that's how you do it.